Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Scarecrow Gaming, and I'm back with another mod review of updating Fallout Ultimum C Capitalum mod review. That's right, it got an update, and I can actually review it since it doesn't require external assets of the LC. Uh, lucky me. So, let's go ahead and check it out. So, if you're looking for the uh, way to get to Fallout Capitalum Ultimum, you have to take a vertebrate that's next to Vault 111. So, let's head on over. Now, the last time I reviewed this mod, it got an insane amount of views on my channel, and also wasn't even cl close to being done, so I'm hoping that this update has added a lot more. So let's see what it's all added. Now, if I go to check out the video right now, see how many- holy crap, we're here. Okay. Okay, so that just takes you back to the Commonwealth. Anyways, uh, the video that I... That video has now reached 1,674 views. Alright, so here we are. Okay, I think that's broken. Okay, sure, I'll go to the vault next door and ask if we can borrow one of the gecks. No biggie. Okay. So, just actual dialogue and shit. Seems to take a second, though. This is no joking matter. The gek is the only thing that can save us from spending our entire lives down here. Now, get that gek. All right. All right. Let's do this. Legit am really confused. Door's already open. It's a ladder on out. The west. To the west, to the west. Everybody take a step over to the west. Boom. Alright, so we're, apparently this takes place in the West, Vault 37. So that's Vault 37. Alright, John, that's awesome to hear that you're playing Fallout uh, 3. That's pretty cool, man. By the way, I'm reviewing this as I live stream. Alright, so there we got a guy named here, Draco. He's not saying anything, so I'm just going to ignore him. So, let's see, if that's Vault 37, right over here, let's head on out. Okay, so it looks like they've attempted to add in more stuff. So, I don't see much change or difference. Maybe just a little bit more mountains and shit. If you folk in the lives, you can give me one second as I'm trying to do a walkthrough of this. Um, Alright, so let's see if this vault has changed at all. Okay, so this is a lot different than what it was before. Okay, so it's definitely still a work in progress because it just opened me up to a void of nothingness. That's trippy as fucking hurts my eyes. Alright. Okay, then. Alright, so he's updated the uh, vault. 
It's made it a lot different. I haven't seen any actual buildings on the outside. Okay, trippy as balls right there. Alright, so this is all that he's done to this vault. No idea what number this vault is. Um, definitely needs to add a pitch black uh, thing covering that up or doing something. He's gotten a lot better with it. I will admit that. Uh, there's a bug right there. Um, definitely interesting what he's done. He needs to definitely fix those issues with the white void. So I'm going to walk over here because it looks like he's added it in another mountain and stuff. That makes me think that he's probably added more. Okay, Brotherhood of Steel. These are all obviously supposed to be paladins, but they're not. Okay, so there's a lot of mountains over here. I don't see any map markers in this direction, but he's definitely added in more landmass. Probably more mountains. <laughs> he needs to add more detailing to it. I, I understand this is a work in progress, by the way. Whatever this is playing for, it's a huge-ass canyon. That's all I gotta say. Um, I'm not gonna be as big of a dick on this now that I know it's a, uh, work in progress, because I, before I didn't know anything about the mod, and when I made that, um, video on what it's about, people commented on there and let me know, so I have to thank every single one of you for, who, that commented on there for the information that you gave me. Okay. No, this is a definitely a huge canyon. Um, let's head there. We'll fast travel to Vault 37. And I guess we'll have to guess our location on where to run to. I don't know. At least the companions followed me. Alright. Um, there's supposed to be a laser RCW in this, but this is not the laser RCW. This is the chrome laser thing. I went the wrong direction. Hmm. Said, I'm sorry, Mama. Do, do, do. I'm gonna have to run around all the way around this for real. Why are you being serial right now? All right. Oh sweet, he made a landmass connecting that now. Oh shit, what is this? Okay, interesting stuff. There are bridges. There are buildings. There's a church. <gasps> Bilber Ward! Alright! Here we go! Alright. So this is probably the most interesting part of the whole thing. Ray Erisimbra. Okay. So this is supposed to be, uh... I guess this is supposed to be taking place out west in near uh, California. Because. Do, 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 Those are labeled Jackal. And the Jackal were in Fallout New Vegas. What are you wearing? That's not the usual Child of Adam attire. I'm kind of curious. Huh. 
Not gonna. Not gonna stop me. Huh. That's cool. I can just kill them. What's this? Leads nowhere. Alright. Make us a progress. So I saw I did see the trailer that he put out on his channel. That's why I was excited when I for this mod because I saw that he's actually getting a lot of stuff done with it adding in actual places. Because in his trailer, he had it zoom out like it does in every Fallout game trailer. And I also saw a workshop. Which makes me really even more excited because I like building shit. But I can't go in there. Interesting. Let's kill these jackals. If they obviously aren't going to fight. You need to figure that out. I'll tell you that, um, Fallout Capital, um, Ultimum, you need to get your shit together and make actual dangerous enemies! I wanna get cut the fuck up! So I'm guessing this is probably meant to be a town, or eventually. Boy. So where is that one location that had the um, intro? Because this obviously isn't it. Because I, I remember what that looked like. And there was also a uh, workshop there. Okay, you definitely need to make the shore to where you can actually climb back up if you jump off. Just a, just a note. Like maybe add a dock here or something. All I'm going to say. Uh, yep. Yeah, uh, it's impossible to get back up pretty much. A second. Uh, All right, this is embarrassing. There we go. And while you can get up back up, I don't recommend falling off. Alright, let me look at the map for a little bit. Uh. Uh. Alright, I don't see anything else on the map, so I'm assuming that's it. If it isn't, oh well. But I'm not gonna spend like how that, all that time I did on um, like I how I did on the last one. I'm uh, searching around, so. Thank you guys so much for tuning into this episode of Mod Review. Um, this is definitely an updated version of Capital um, Ultimum. I definitely recommend that yeah, you guys all should go and check it out um, because, and number one, it's it's a work in progress. So give the guy some support, like give a give a rating to it and all. I'm definitely hoping that he doesn't update it with DLC in the future because that would be one of the few new location mods that doesn't use DLC assets. Um, and I think that would be really cool because there's plenty of irregular main base game assets from what I can see. Because one, Bethesda's done some unique shit with the, um just base game, and two, uh, yeah, they've done some really cool shit with just base game. So I don't think the far far Haba and Nuka Will DLC is needed, um, it's, and the contraptions workshop DLCs and stuff like that. So yeah, guys, if you guys want to see more Fallout Capital um, Ultimate Mod reviews on the channel, make sure you guys go and hit that like button as well. Share out this video to all your friends and family on the Facebooks and the Twitters, and I'll be keeping you guys updated as best I can um, until unless it adds in DLC assets, which I hope it doesn't because they we need a DL we need a new landmass that doesn't use DLC. All of them need to do so far, and it's kind of annoying in my opinion. But that's just my opinion. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, guys, make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button. Share, ring that doorbell. Share, share this video out to all your friends and family on the Facebooks and the Twitter. And as always, keep it easy, keep sexy, and keep it active. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace and have a wonderful day. Bye.